Let's see. Hello, 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 hello. How are y'all? All right, you little hand, go down a little bit. Hi, guys, welcome. I have another little life for you guys. Hopefully, you guys are not doing anything. Hi, guys. Welcome, welcome. So, I'm just going to prep my little hand over here. I was even thinking to maybe do a thumb, but then I have to hold the hand. So, we back with Maria with her other hand. We back. So... Let me shove these in there. Um, hello everyone. Welcome, welcome, welcome. So ready, Guana does have these little nails, like specifically for the fingers. They don't come with sizes, so it tells you where they belong. Just in case you guys bought a ready guana hand. I mean, you could also use any other full well nail tips that you may have. Um, but I've been using these because, pues, me las dieron, ¿verdad? I gotta use them. I gotta use them, honey. She can't afford no thumb. Yeah, she don't got a fucking thumb, so she she don't get one. And the other hand that I have is not magnetic. So, it's like, do I really want to be holding the hand or, or nay? And more likely, like, nay. I didn't want to. I didn't want to. The magnet is actually pretty strong. Damn, I'm going to shut this fucking phone up. Who is messaging? Who is? Hold on, let me mute my phone. All right. No more estorbos, por favor. So, today, I'm not going to do Halloween. I think I said it. I think I saw somebody say something Halloween. I'm going to do fall nails. I feel like the ones that I did last time were a little Halloween vibes. Like, you can rock them in October, November, December, whatever. Toxica vibes, but we need a little orange up in here. I love orange colors. And <clears throat> we need to get this fall on. Got a transition from fall and fall and October. Fall and October. So... Let's see. Should I do square nails or coffin on my little friend? What would you guys like to see on her? I know you guys are going to say coffin. So let me already look for those nails. I did stiletto on her last time. So I feel like y'all going to choose coffin. Let's see. All right. Let's do a poll. Let's do a little poll. How the fuck? Okay, okay, okay. If you guys want to see square, do happy face. If you want to... Oh, damn. You already started a poll? Okay. Um, oh, no, never mind. Um, do crime face for coffin. A happy face for square. Oh, wait. These are C-curve. C-curve. Let's see. So, if you guys want square nails, do the happy face. If you want coffin, do the sad face. Okay, girl. I guess square nails is winning. Let me put these back where they belong. And, um, let me find my square nail. <sighs> okay, I just had them. All right, so I think Square is winning, right? All right, let me go steal the item of the day <laughs> because I messed up my nail tip cutters the other day on live yesterday, I think, or the day before. So, oh, wait, I have some right here. Never mind. I'm not stealing nothing. Just kidding. 
I have my other ones right here. Oh, damn, my titty. My titty bumped into you guys. All right. I love Square, but I'm a little tired of Square. Is all my clients get. I am loving Square nails. Like, I like... I guess these... I consider these coffin, but compared to the skinny coffin, they look a little bit more square. I don't know why, but I just like them. All right, hold on. My friend here has pretty slim fingers, so she is about a size 5 in her middle finger. And then... Let's see... I think she's going to be a number six on her index. And most of the time, people are the same size. Their index and their ring finger are the same. So, she is size six on both other fingers. Hello, hello, hello. Um, What nail tips are on your practice hand? Those are the ones from Red Iguana. They sent them to me for the hand. So, in the packaging, it says this one is for the half hand. And then I guess the full hand has different ones. I don't know. Full hand replacement tips and half hand. All right, let's see. So they were missing the pinky. Um, One of these days, I think I'm going to have like a little live with like nail art or something like hand painted. I really want to get into that a little bit more, you know. Got a... Um, oh, the fuck? This shit is big. Hold on. I'm a little confused because this box is backwards. So the zero's here and then the pinky's over here. Like, the fuck? Did they make this box for a lefty? The fuck, honey? Confusing shit. I'm confused. Oh, shit. So this morning I made myself a coffee. I made myself a coffee. And can you guys believe I haven't finished it all? Well, I made myself three shots of espresso in my new cup. I've been scrubbing it, like washing it and all of that. So check it out. It's so beautiful still. It's gorgeous. I've been getting all kinds of compliments. And because the ice doesn't melt, the ice is still there from the morning, bitch. Mm-mm-mm bomb okay now let me glue these bitches on i'm gonna be using my zule nail glue i don't know where i left the the little squeeze bottle at so i'm just gonna use this one and i have noticed that this hand the index finger is crooked like i don't know if you guys can tell but like the nail at the tip is kind of like eh, go that way so I had been struggling like, bitch, am I putting the nail crooked or what the fuck? I was like, what the hell? What the hell? I think I'm going to that to my, oh, you're going to do that to your phone case? Yes, girl. I'm going to do that to um my iPad cover, actually. I just bought a new one and I'm going to bedazzle it. I also bought myself a... I bought myself a, how to call it, a Disney hat that I will be bedazzling and adding pearls to as well. I love pearls, so I can't wait for it to get here. I bought it on Etsy. Be right back. We're to get a nice coffee. Okay, Paige, girl. Are you joking? Okay, are you going to put this on live on YouTube? Yes, I always put my lives on YouTube, but I have been going on live so much that I have a lot of videos um, pending still. I was going to upload one today that I did. Um, let's see, what fucking else are they? Oh, I think they're the orange ones on the other hand. These. We did them... Last week, I think. I don't fucking remember. Um, I'm going to be uploading these tomorrow. I was going to do it today, but then I was like, no, I'll just save it for Friday, right? Tomorrow's Friday for y'all bitches that don't got shit to do on Fridays. So this was our set last time that we did. Today, we're going to do 
uh, fall action as well. So I'm going to keep these right in my face so I don't try to um, do the same thing. And then what else do I have? I have a few other sets in between that I have not posted. So I have at least five more videos um, to post before I get to this one. So this video probably going to be up in like a month and shit. <laughs> okay. So let me flip her fucking hand. Make sure her nails. This bitch, her finger go that way. So... When I file it, I'm going to hold it straight and it looks straight. But because it go that way, it's a little crooked. So these are the 3XL square nails from my website. Now, my client here doesn't want them that long. So we're going to go ahead and trim them a little bit. She says she can't function with 3X. So she wants them a little shorter, like just like this, like this. Okay, right there is fine. Okay, girl, you I could have just put you fucking to Excel then. The fuck? Oh, okay. This is still longer. All right, all right, all right. Whatever. So my client here trying to start some trouble already, huh? All right, let me measure her now. So that middle finger is definitely, definitely longer. All right, let me trim them a little bit. So... One thing that I've learned is that the ring finger always is longer than goes longer. So if you measure from cuticle to cuticle, the middle finger should always be like a hairline longer than the rest. And personally, that's what I like. Okay. And then the ring finger matches the index finger and they will look even steaming, you know. And the pinky, for some reason, always goes shorter. The thumb as well goes longer. So see, this one is already a tad bit shorter, so they look even. It's like a trick of the eye, you know? This hand is called Nicole on readyguana.com. If you guys want to purchase it, you can go shop on her store. I have a discount code. My name is, I mean, <laughs> the discount code is Zule. If you want to save a little coin, but if you don't, then... Go ahead. Um, just check out no code. Um, I do recommend though if you're gonna invest in this hand to how to call it, um, get the clamp. So let me show it to you guys really quickly. It has a little suction at the bottom, so it's best for you. Excuse me, it grips best to glass, okay. Um, and then I didn't know that it goes longer just a little bit like how close do you want your client to be Do you want her to lean like a shola or not? You know, so right now I have it at the second because then she, this bitch too close to me Like girl Sit your ass down All right, and then it has a mag a magnet and At first I was like bitch. This is not gonna stay but the magnet is pretty strong. Okay, and I just wish the other hand that I have that they gave me, this one, had a magnet. So it comes, I guess it has another type of clamp with a hole. I'm going to have to go buy that one because I'm trying to do thumbs as well. But I don't want to hold the bitch, you know. So this one is in shade Nicole. I just call her Maria. This is my Maria client, but her real name on the where on their website is called Nicole. And it's the non-posable. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and start shaving these little corners right here. Just very lightly. Um, I'm rolling. Why are you rolling, honey? Yeah. So, and the other one is called... Um, fuck. I, I don't even remember what she's called to be honest is she maria this one is maria huh the other one does she have a name i don't fucking remember if she has a name or not um we are going to be doing a fall set what tips are these these are my 3xl squares but i trimmed them down just a bit I feel like these are still a little bit longer than the 2XL. So just slightly shorter than the, I mean, slightly longer than the 2XL. But 
we trimmed a little bit because my client she can't function with the tip she told me just cut the tip just cut the tip so hold on to me take that one off so i could file the edge because i be cutting my clients and shit like i ain't trying to get no lawsuit over here like the fuck no toxicas over here i have a whole reunion poor toxica she she's getting jealous because we haven't showed her love hold on it's she has like growth she hasn't been here in a long time so her nails are growing oh fuck oh fuck She's going to need a fill. She said she wants a fill. I told her she's crazy. She needs a full set already. She needs a fill. Bitch, you need fucking no nail, honey. And all her bling is still there. Still there, okay? <laughs> she don't do shit. This bitch don't do shit with her life. All right. Um. All right, guys. Enough joking around. Let's get started. So today I'm finally going to, I'm finally going to get to use my color that I've been wanting, um, Chai Spice. I don't think I've ever used it on a live yet or whatever. So let's see what color I'm going to be matching it with. Let's see. I feel like I really want to do Chai Spice. Is that a real human hand? Yes, her name is Maria. My client's name is Maria, guys. Ooh, you know what? I don't have clear acrylic. That's what I didn't have. So this is what Chai Spice looks like. It's so fucking pretty. I'm going to put it here for you guys to look at. Gorgeous. I just bought myself a cardigan in this color. So pretty. It's like um, like a two-tone-ish color. All right, so I guess I do have to go steal after all. All right, let me go steal from my store real quick. Meanwhile, don't go anywhere. I need to go get some clear acrylic because I finished the one I had last time. So let me go get it real quick. Scared the shit out of me. <sighs> Lenny scared me. Dude, I almost had a heart attack. Fucking Lenny. That little fucker creeping up on me like that. <sighs> dude, let me drink some coffee, dude. It's because I went to get um clear acrylic, right? And when I opened the door, he was like looking at me like, like if he was it, the clown, like just staring like, the fuck, where'd you come from, motherfucker? All right, so let me see if I want to use this color. Ooh. Oh my God. Should I use that color? Or... Fucking Lenny. All right, let me do this one. Ooh, this one is pretty. I think I'm going to use that one on a nail. Definitely looks like a pumpkin. Pumpkin pie. Hold on. This number is 117, just in case y'all are going to ask. Because once I open it, then I cannot look. And I'm going to be using Cover Nude Pink. Cover Nude Pink. That's my favorite nude color. 
All right, Maria, you only have two fucking four fingers, so we got to keep this kind of simple, but not too simple. Let's start off with a solid color. Um, number 117. Hola, Suley, where you from? I'm from California, and you? Oh, shit, I need a bigger brush. Um, no, I do not do poly gel. I have never, ever, ever done poly gel in my life. So I'm going to see if I can keep these a little basic, you know. This color looks like pumpkin pie, I swear. It looks a little bit darker in the camera, but it ain't. How do I pick up my beads? I just um kind of bounce it like one, two, three. All right, hold on. Let me fix my camera. This color is number 117. And all my acrylics with numbers can be used with for dip method as well. They are slower drying. So if you guys do need more time to work with, those are perfect for you. You can fix your little lumps and bumps. Um, This hand is from Red Iguana. So I like to hold it in my brush a little bit, the acrylic, um, before I place it on the hand so that it's ready to start like pressing versus me having to chase it or anything like that. Never met uh, anyone with the with the same as me do mm? you have the same name so i'm just gonna bring it up to the cuticle what acrylic is that this one is number 117 it is gorgeous honey it, it looks like camote how do you say camote in, in English? It says camote. No, but how do you say it for real? It's camote. Camote? You're lying. <laughs> Yams. Oh, <laughs> Yams. I kind of felt like it was that. Okay, so this is like a yam color. I'm just going to add a little bit more at the tip. Sweet potato is mano is the silicone. Si sí, amiga is the red iguana punto com. I was lost asking in English. Sweet potato, I I get so yeah. No, these acrylics are from my website. This is my brand. Oh shit, I have a fucking glitter on here. God damn it, get out of here, glitter. Everything that I am using is from my website la mano is the red iguana the only thing that i'm using today that does not belong to my brand is the hand it is from red iguana all right so this one is going to stay like that and it is nice and thin um i like to apply very thin color you don't really need a lot you don't need a lot of color and then the rest is um gonna be with clear so i i wanted to do fall because i found these stickers i had them since last year so i was like oh my god girl i need to do that on a nail man I need to do it on a nail. I need to. So, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do one nail mat. I mean, one nail nude. So, I think it's going to be this one. Where are you located? I am located in California, my friend. I don't know if I should do a... No, no, no. No French today, Zule. No French. You've been doing too many motherfucking Frenches. Mm. 
the way you said it omg where in cali so i work in um la but i live in the desert over here in beaumont beaumont california far as fuck so i think i'm gonna put the little leaves at the tip i'm just carefully thinning down the cuticle area i was gonna do the nail clear but then i realized that the nail beds are not clear so i'm like shit i cannot leave it clear Do you have those on your website? Um, if you're talking about the stickers, yes. I uploaded them earlier when I found them. Because sometimes I take away I take away the items that are not in season. So I'm just going to leave it like that and let it dry so I can put my stickers on there right now. And then the ring finger I'm going to do with the flitter. I'm going to do the little flitter. So fucking pretty. Fall is in the air. Are any of you guys against like fall? You guys don't like fall colors? I remember when I was younger, I did not like fall. I'd be like, ooh, those colors are ugly. But now, I love them. Personally, I stick with pinks. Okay. I love pink, too. I love fall colors. I love fall autumn vibes. Mm -hmm. Acrylic shade. I am using... um. Number 117, Chai Spice and Cover Pink Nude. What, Jimena? You hate? You hate pink? Was your favorite color? Was your favorite color? OMG. I like pinks, purples, and Sipping with Reina colors. Okay. So, like, pink and purple category? Um... Oh, your favorite color is black. I used to hate pink, but now I love it. Yeah, Portia girlfriend. Damn, these comments are moving a little too fast for me today, girlfriend. <laughs> what the hell? Pink is a lifestyle. Hell yeah. This glitter is called Chai Spice. So I'm going to be adding um some fall colors to our scoops this month. Um, I don't have a date yet for them as I am still, well, I just started prepping. Like I have my mom, um, prepping the acrylics, um, filling them in, filling them up. I mean, and then I'm still missing a couple things. There are some colors that I'm missing. So I'm waiting to see when the fuck they plan to arrive. So I can tell you guys. If they're not going to arrive anytime soon, then I can just get this party started, you know? So this is going to be one of the colors on the scoop. So if you're lucky enough, you'll get this gala. So pretty. All our colors are bomb. Especially, I feel like my favorite... Nah, just kidding. I can't even say that the fall ones are my favorite favorite. Because I feel like the floral collection is another favorite. It's like a tie, bitch. But definitely, the floral collection and the fall collection is my favorite, favorite, favorite as of right now. Look, let me sh get, show you guys real quick the colors. Look, check it out. These are some of the colors. I don't know what the fuck happened to my other swatches, but honey, they look like they're similar, but they ain't. So this one is the one I'm using, the Chai Spice. And then this one is Cinnamon. It's so pretty too. I think I'm going to use that one next. 
And then we have pumpkin spice over here. They're like different little glitters mixed together. Oh my God, they're so pretty. And then I have an espresso color, which is also really, 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 really nice. But I think I took the colors to my, um, ay, wey, me jale la greña. I took it to the salon. Um, this color, I just added it to our scoops. We had it last year, I believe. Sorry, little napkin got stuck because I spilled monomer. Um, this one is called Carrot. I know, like, what kind of fucking name is that? So this one is going to be in my scoops. Check it out. Let me put top coat. It's so pretty. For those of you guys who don't like, like, dark orange. I don't know if it looks dark, but it's like a nice, bright, holographic orange. So nice. I, I wanted to use that one on, on my nails today, but I was like... Things. I feel like this one kind of matched better with the leaves. <sighs> Fall is my favorite, my all time favorite. Alrighty, enough teasing. I was like, I'm gonna tease all these bitches, bitches and hoes, cause it's so fucking pretty. These nails would look really nice with black as well. So if you guys not like a super big orange fan, you could always add a black nail. All right. I think my nail should be um ready for the decals. If you apply stickers while the nail's not um, dry yet, it won't stick. So that's why I've been waiting. So let me peel them to see which ones I'm going to want. So I really like the one that says, hello, Autumn. Hello. And then we'll probably put one from this one, too. Hi, Dory. Hi. How are you? Let me get my little tweezers. Ay, que la verga. No puedo abrirlos. So, these are like a holographic gold with a little black in them. So pretty. Let me get my handy dandy tweezers. Why you fire? All right, let's see. Which one can I use? I'm gonna use this bottom one. For a second, I felt like this this thing down here was like Jack Skellington. All right, man, please fold. Oh, even on that, it looks so pretty. I can't draw, so I use stickers. What's the actual name of the hand? This one is called, um, um, fuck. Uh, oh, yes, Nicole. Thank you, Portia. Nicole, I had a brain fart for a second. All right, so next I'm going to try one of these little long, funny looking ones. They remind me of a fucking donut, bitch. Fat girl problems. So, if you don't know how to draw, I recommend that you get decals because, oh shit, because they will come through for you, okay? Let me see. I'm going to try a different one, this one. So, I don't really know how to draw. So, for me, decals is my thing, all right? I'm going to put one here like they're falling, they're falling. And then, let's see, do we have another one? Um, Should I put a fucking branch? Are those cherries or a motherfucking branch, honey? I don't fucking know what it is. Um, but I'm going to put one of these little branches. Um, yeah. Or should I put one of these? <sighs> Let me look. 
the possibilities here are endless, guys. Zule, you can draw. Well, I try, but sometimes it's like, honey, what is that? <laughs> okay, I'm going to put this leaf right here, actually. I'm going to put this one. I'm going to put it right here like they're falling type of vibes. All right. That's that's enough sticker. And then this one over here is kind of sticking out a little bit. So when I encapsulate it, it's going to get filed off. So anything sticking out is going to get filed off. All right. I'm going to put a little bit of this same chai spice glitter. So I'm just going to grab it from my napkin just to like give it a little touch of fall. I don't want to like put too, too much, but you already know, honey, that I be putting a lot. Just a little bit. And then I'm going to go in with my color Fancy just to give it a little bit more bling bling. So this color is an iridescent gold. Oh, so fucking pretty. Just put it on, guys. Put it on. Who cares? Touch the stickers. Just make it like a little sparkly. pretty like we have a little transparency but we need some flitter some flitter isn't that fucking cute though oh my god do you have a set schedule when you go live i do not so this is what the color actually looks like it doesn't have top coat yet but it's so pretty i love it 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 has like gold specks and clear ones and bomb. Bomb, bomb, bomb. It matches with fucking anything. I've been wanting to do like a royal blue nail set with that one. Fancy. You fancy, huh? Hell yeah. Okay. Um the one that I just used is called um um fancy all right i think i'm gonna do another another one of this one hold on let me cover the glitter ones so i can't believe that i'm actually gonna do simple today oh my gosh i could probably even do two sets like, if we were to have two hands. Alrighty. So, let me do the pinky now. The pinky would look really nice black. You are right. Should I do it black? Go get Toxica in with it, for real. Should I add black? What do you guys think? Or should I do, if I finish this one really fast, I could do the next set in black. Yeah, that's what I could do. All right, I'll do the second hand with black because it's still early. I mean, not that I'm done yet, but it looks like I'll be hella done. Oh, you guys started a poll? <laughs> Is the pole still going on? Yeah, I'm going to be adding crystals to it. I'm going to let's see. I already started, but I could take it off right now. Okay. Ooh, the black is winning, honey. What the hell, man? <laughs> Brown would be beautiful. Ombre. Ombre. All right. No black. Do you have olive green? I do have an olive green. Okay, I'm going to do this one with this color. Damn, I already got messy on my fucking glove. The next hand, I will combine with black. Because there is some... Look at it. The stickers do have a little bit of black. So I feel like it would go nicely. 
<laughs> I'm in love with these nails, but I would never be able to wear that length. Don't worry, girl. You could always wear shorter. I don't know. I feel like Black would have thrown this head off. Mm, that's what you think, girl. But it will make it look so nice. Don't worry. I'll show you guys in the next hand. Sometimes we think certain things are going to look kind of weird. You can't see it. But once you see it, you're going to be like, oh, my God, you're right. All right, hold on. Let me lower my stupid hand. Bitch, can you bend your nail? Can you bend your finger for me, please? Can you do 3D fall leaves on the next nails? Um, and let me think about that one. That's a good one. I did it a long time ago. I can only do the normal leaves. I can't do like the five petal ones. Cooperate, Maria. Uh -huh. Bend your finger, honey. Bend your finger. Please. Oh, you love the pro. Oh, my God. I thought you were talking to a real customer. I am. She real. She real. Her money ain't real, but she pretty real. Oh, my gosh. I'm going to really want these little stickers on myself now. Can we see your nails? Yes. Just that my nails are a little dry. My finger is a little dry right now. Hi, Nancy. I didn't even see you in here, girl. This color is number 117. 117. This hand is Red Iguana Hand in color Nicole. So pretty. Love it. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, my friends. Thank you very much. Come again. This color is so fucking pretty, I swear. I kind of want pumpkin pie now. Pumpkin pie? I, f what? You oh, you keep cuticle in your desk? Cuticle oil? I have cuticle oil right here too, and I don't be putting it. Sometimes I lick my fingers when I'm going to take a picture just so that they won't be dry. Sweet potato pie. Do they have that sweet potato pie? If they do, I never tried that. Girl, been here since you started. Oh, okay. Sorry, it's because these comments move too fast for me. Right now, it's like I, I'm i trying to look at the corner of my eye, but don't recognize the faces. Yes, Ule, don't tell. Ooh, que la verga se movió. Don't tell me you haven't tried it. I have never tried it. Oh my God, no, Zule, you must try I'm going to have to go to the store and look for it. All right, you little flitter. What you doing in here, yo? Get out. Get out of the nail. No flitter on this nail. We're going to put bling, honey. What the fuck? How long you been on here? We've been on here for... Um, 44 minutes. Damn. It's been that long. I'm a pumpkin pie person too. Me too. 15 minutes? It has not been 15 minutes. It feels hard, but it hasn't. It's been 44 minutes. I checked. Time be flying when you're having fun. Yup, I want to go steal merch. Um, what else did I do in between? Hold on. I, I feel like I need a little bit more in the corner. 
when are the scoops happening i don't know amiga i don't have a date as of yet i was hoping to have done them this weekend but it's not happening i don't have my product though all right so let me close this damn you were stealing early <laughs> I know it's because I ran out of clear acrylic. <clears throat> All right, now let me encapsulate my nail. Ooh, that is so cute. The little happy meal. Thank you, whoever got me that. How much would the set cost? Um, Just the length itself, I would charge over 120 cookies. Just like this basic. Hold on, there's, there's flitter. Flitter. Ah, thank you, Irma. So I'm gonna encapsulate the glitter first, only because I have glitter in my brush. That was me. I sent the Happy Meal. So cute. Thank you so much. I have never seen that before. So cute. Did you guys get your adult Happy Meal at McDonald's? Homemade sweet potato pie. Mm -hmm. I hate pumpkin pie. Portia, what? What? Have you had Tres Leches cake before? How do you feel about gel X? Um, I mean, I don't have any negative thoughts or anything about it. I kind of like it. I was even thinking I should do my next set in gel extension. Excuse me. Because I haven't really done that. And I have a lot of beautiful polishes that y'all be needing to have in your collection. If you guys are into gel. So I feel like I pretty much show you guys a lot of acrylic. So I need to switch it up a little bit. And um, I need to practice my gels. My gel nail art or application or whatever. So that's why I was thinking maybe next time when I do my nails. I'll do them gel extension. You know for any of you guys that do that. I mean I'm not a professional at them. But, I mean, I I approve of gel extensions, if that's what you were searching for. Like, if I love or hate them. I know there's people who don't like them. But, I mean, it's not for everybody. So, I'm using my clear acrylic. And this one does dry fairly fast. So, that's why I'm going a little bit faster here. If I see Christmas set right now, I'm really going to lose my mind. Already tired of seeing Halloween. Oh, my God. I know. I went to Target or where did I go? And they already have Christmas shit. Like, Felicia, relax. I know I want Christmas to come quickly, but damn. October just started. Yo, let me enjoy November. <laughs> Let me enjoy November, but it's just October. Like, honey. Yeah, my hubby wanted me to buy shit for like... Well, he thought I was going to buy stuff for Christmas. I'm like, no, I ain't buying nothing right now. I refuse. I refuse to fall into the store's... Um, peer pressure here to buy Christmas stuff. No. Not gonna do it. Like, I love Christmas, but damn. Oh, that is so cute. The little doggy. <laughs> Thank you, Boba. That is such a cute little doggy. I think that's the one that Patrick wants. Like, the real thing. Okay, so that nail is ready. It's nice and thick. Like my... I can't even say it because I'm going to get blocked. Hey, Zule. Hi. So 
so let me encapsulate this one no i'm not doing a human being i'm just doing my friend here maria she is made out of silicone and no she did not get her titties did or her bbl she literally made out of silicone all right so let's encapsulate and whenever you guys are encapsulating i recommend to go a little wetter especially if you working with um fast drying acrylics as you may know they dry faster than normal so they're gonna be our best friends in the winter time but in the meantime that it's a little warmer out try to apply wet a little bit more wet to avoid any like bubbles sometimes the bubbles are a little inevitable depending on the colors for some reason they just show up on a certain color more than others or whatever the fuck um but the weather be crazy it was fucking rainy bitch like where did the rain come from is it was hot as shit earlier okay let's see and then make sure to clean your brushes so that your acrylic does not stick that is very important. What state are you in? I'm in California. I am in California. I tried my first nail. It looked like a demon. What? Why? Talking about Demon, yesterday I watched the movie It. That shit kind of creeped me out. I do not like scary movies, but that shit was kind of like scary. I think that's why Lenny scared me right now, because I thought it was It. The last time I watched like the first movie, the original one, I was in third grade. That shit freaked me the fuck out. And then yesterday I watched the movie. It was kind of funny. I liked it. Just not when the fucking clown came out. I was like, bitch, I'm going to fucking have nightmares. Um, I don't have a restock date for the dampened dish either. I'm waiting for my, um, for my next delivery. I still haven't watched it all yet. It is. It was funny. I mean, I'm down to watch another one again. Okay, let me just fix the tip. Like, it was scary, but funny. So, I kind of like that. If the movie is, like, straight scary, like, ooh, I don't know about that one. What do you think about frozen flower designs? I haven't had any chance to practice. Frozen flower? Uh, I don't know what you, what that is. Um, so in the winter, use fast curing acrylic and in the summer is regular. Yes, preferably that's the way it will go. Because if you use fast drying acrylic in the summer, most of the time it dries too fast for you to work with. And in the winter, our product becomes water literally with the, with the cold. So acrylic that dries faster will dry at normal speed in the cold if that makes sense i hope that does make sense um watch smile what is that shit about is that shit scary you bitches better not be trying to scare me over here i hate clowns me too you took the hand for your boyfriend uh-huh Sure did, I bought half off. Russian design. Oh, I haven't seen it. I have not seen that design then. What the hell, you glitters? This is why I hate doing glitter sometimes because then it ends up everywhere. Ugh. Fucking glitter. 
fucking flitter. Get out of here. Get, get. Oh, well, I guess I just encapsulated one deep down in there. Oh, well, it's going to live free. Free. Free rent up in here in this nail. Love the color. Yes, honey. It's so pretty, huh? Yes, rent free. Uh, after like... 6 p.m. My brain is a little slower, so I can't really think. Like, I can't process my words and my thoughts. My mouth is slow. Actually, my brain slows down. Hi. Hello, everyone. Welcome, welcome, welcome. And for my little YouTube channel in the future, when you guys watch this, welcome. Hey, I'm coming to live in Zule's store rent free. <laughs> Be like, Portia, clean your room. I mean, Portia, Paige, clean your room. Pack your orders, pack the orders. All right, hold on. Let me get some more manama. All right, let me get my manama. Do you have to encapsulate every nail? Yes, I choose to. I always encapsulate all the nails. Like I say each and every time, color acrylic does not have the same strength as clear acrylic does. So I always apply a very, very thin coat of color and glitter. And then I encapsulate with clear to give it the thickness and the strength that the nail, um, that the nail needs. Now, you don't have to do it to every every color. I normally don't do it to nudes because those have um more clear in them. So they do have the strength to hold up the nail without breaking and stuff, but not cover uh, not colored acrylics. And how to color, there will be some that you can just leave like that. But you don't want to waste your product like that. Because, you know, this happened to me a long time ago. So I guess I'm kind of um, traumada that I used to buy certain colors from a certain brand or whatever. Or not, not even colors, just anything in general. I fall in love with that thing item. And then this is continued like, what? What do you mean discontinue bitch so um if you use a little bit at a time then you will not oh shit there's little bubbles in there you will not use up all your favorite color and no need of having a heart attack because it's discontinued what advice would you give to prevent gems from falling um first of all are you using the Zule bling adhesive? Because if you're not, then you need that, honey. You need that glue in your life. That one and the cluster gel are your two besties. Trust me when I say that. Hmm. That's the secret, okay? Nah, it's not even a secret. It's just... It's just... um. What do you call it? It's just a fact. I had that problem when I started doing nails. And I'm grateful I was able to share it with y'all. Because let me tell you. We were all struggling on the same boat. I thought the secret was super glue. That's what I use. Should I not be doing that? You should not be using super glue on nails, honey. Um, 
Um, yeah, I used the 3XL nail tips, but I did trim them a little bit. I'm ghetto. Mm, well, don't be putting that on your skin or your nails, honey, because you're going to be ripping off your skin. I used to use super glue, too. I'm sure a lot of people use all kinds of shit. I'm not even going to lie. Once, a long, long time ago, I tried, um, what the fuck is it called? The E6000 glue to put a cluster on. Because one of my clients told me they did that for her at a salon. And I'm over here trying it. You know, hell no, it did not fucking work. That shit fell off in one whole piece. I was like, okay, honey. Yeah, but glue, regular glue or nail glue is not the same as gel glue. So if you guys like fast drying glue, then use like the bling adhesive. If you like to have control when your shit dries, then use a cluster gel or glue gel. Well, I use KDS glue ones, not super glue. Let me correct myself. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That one is too thin, so it will not hold up your your bling ling ling. Your bling ling ling ling. Welcome in. I was asking if I wrong for using super glue on nail because I'm broke as fuck. Well, don't worry, honey. We have quality products. You you can be broke as fuck, but using actual nail products. Don't worry, honey. We're here to teach you. And just FYI, don't go to Home Depot to buy a Dremel, okay? Just because it's cheaper. And we're talking about this last time on Another Life. When we broke or whatever, because we all started somewhere. You don't want to use the cheapest things, okay? Yeah, it's good to find like good quality low lower end stuff but don't try to cut corners on things that are not nail related they're not nail related for a reason like i follow this lady um her name is what's her name i forgot her name but she's an older lady and she's talking she was talking about how uh, um all kinds of oh shit the nail was stuck Maria, que hiciste? Like all these hacks that people on TikTok be having that are so bad to even be doing. And I'm like, fuck, for real. Like some people be causing almost explosions in their house. But just not even, not just nails, but like we're not supposed to be mixing certain chemicals in general. Like even cleanings and all of that. So if it's not... It's not meant for nails. It's not meant for your hair. It's not meant for your lashes or for your toilet. Don't mix it. Do not use it just because it's cheaper. You want to be safe. You'd rather be safe than sorry. Um, TikTok is a devil. That's why I only get on to watch you... For real, I'm like, I cannot believe that people really believe half the shit they see on here. Like the day that um that I posted that I charged 3K for some nails, all the fucking comments, and it's still going and going and go going. And it's not the first time I used that audio, so it was pretty shocking this time around. Like, the fuck? Y'all really believe that shit? I mixed cleaning chemicals a couple years ago and I was clean, shower, and literally almost passed out. Yes, that shit is dangerous. Like, I see people mixing all kinds of fucking cleaning shits on their toilet. One girl almost fucking clogged it with all the things she put in there. I was like, what the fuck? Off her video? Honey, you gonna fuck up your video? Oh, no. Be careful mixing cleaning chemicals. You can die. It was not just mixing chemicals for for cleaning. The nail industry be mixing all kind of chemicals on nails as well. So that's why I was telling you, don't use nail glue. My husband asked for my old drills. 
Mm-hmm. Y'all needs Fabuloso. <laughs> we love the Fabuloso. Mm-hmm. I can't remember that lady's name, but I just started following her, the Nail Whisperer or something like that. I think that's her name. Why does my polish run when I'm trying to design a Frenchie? You are probably using too much gel or um, a gel that's more runny. It's like you were high. Yeah, I recently came across her and I, I followed her um, because it's true. Sometimes we don't think about a lot of the things that we're doing just to save a little coin or whatever. She was talking about people who that we're not supposed to be mixing um, gel polish with our monomer. Like I, I even tried it once, not even going to lie. I was guilty to stain our acrylic and make other colors and things like that. But those... Those are not supposed to be mixed. Is she on TikTok? Yeah, she's here on TikTok. And I was like, damn, I didn't even think about that, honey. Don't mix monomer with alcohol, ladies, or acetone with alcohol. What does that do? I will have never even tried to mix. They even advertise mixing gel polish with what? With monomer? Uh-uh. Do you feel like it's easier to work with gloves on? I kind of find it. Oh, that it's uncomfortable? Um, I, I always work with gloves for the most part. Um, hold on, hold on. The These fucking comments are good. So, I always work with gloves like at the salon, so I'm used to it. But I only wear one. That's what school is for. They teach you all this in nail school. Well, not everybody learns that, actually. I went to manicure school and I was not taught none of that. But I went years ago. So, I don't know what the fuck they teach nowadays. Um, I've seen so many people mix gel polish with monomer. Me too. Me too. It's like people trying to save a coin, but do we really know what the fuck we doing? <laughs> we gonna make an explosion. Yeah, nail schools don't really teach much. Just what you need to know for state board. And so we learn from each other. Have you ever got contact dermatitis? My hands are horrible i try that's why i actually i actually wear a glove when i work because you're not supposed to come in contact with the chemicals either you have to try to avoid as much contact because over time you will become allergic well there's a high possibility that you can become allergic to the chemicals i had a client once who used to do nails and she was allergic to acetone i'm like what the how? How the fuck are you allergic to acetone? I thought she was fucking with me. So then I was like, how the fuck am I going to remove her nails? Because I didn't know how else to remove nails but to soak, right? And so I had to file her shit and everything. But she told me she used to do nails. And I guess she used to come in contact with the acetone a lot when she did like pedicure removals and things like that. That she became allergic to acetone. And ever since then, I've always really tried to wear, wear a glove. And not just any glove. Um, I use nitro gloves. So these are like for doctors and shit. They don't rip easily. And I really, really like that. Um, And how to call it. So I wear gloves on one hand. Because this hand is the one that's always touching a customer. 
hold when I'm holding their hand. Rarely will this hand come in contact with any any um um it doesn't come in contact with the chemicals. I don't vinyl gloves too. Vinyl gloves? I I don't think I've used those. Wait, what kind of gloves are these again? Nitro, nitro, yeah. My mom is allergic to glue, super glue, any glue products, but I started with nail and super glue. Oh, damn, that's cray cray. But yeah, guys, take care of yourselves. Use a glove, at least one. It is a little uncomfortable in the beginning, but it's more uncomfortable to use two gloves. But at least you wear it on your opposite hand. And at the same time, you're protecting yourself from your client. You don't know where they've been. She, they probably supposedly went to the restroom, scratched their ass, didn't wash it. And you over here have ass on your hands. Uh-uh. Or whatever, you know. At least you have a glove. You don't know. You don't know where they been, shit. Literally, you don't. Once? Oh, my God. Since we're talking about ass over here. I had a client who, I don't know if she was touching herself or touching her man or something. But it smelled kind of funny. Like, you guys already know that down there, it'd be smelling some type of way. Like, not necessarily, like, I don't I don't even know what to explain. But, you know, it was a part, body part that was sweating or something. And I was like, what is that smell? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. My shit fell. And it was her hands. I was like, Lord, even if she washes them, don't go away. So I'm glad I use a fucking glove. I was like, uh uh, I'm trying to be holding her man's wiener over here in my hand. You know, like the fuck. I mean, I didn't bother to ask, but stay protected, guys. Wear a glove. Mm hmm. You guys might think that's funny, but it's true. I'm not joking. It was years ago. So ever since then, I started wearing gloves. I trained myself. I trained myself to wear this motherfucker on my hand. All right. So I'm going to go in with my extra fine bit to remove any little scratches that are left behind on the nail. Uh, it's shocking to me how what many people are really dirty. I don't touch nothing or nobody. Mm -hmm. Yeah, people, some people are cray cray. I love this one client. Her hands always feel so bad. I can smell it through my damn mask. What? Oh, her hands always feel so bad. What do you mean they feel bad? They feel or they smell? Please don't even do something as simple as washing their hands. That bugs me. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Even after COVID, people don't wash their hands. He's like, what the hell? This is how your cup holding up. I'm going to get your glue to make my kettle some. Aww. Yeah, it's holding up pretty good. We put a lot of glue. Mm-hmm. All right, let me get to these nails over here because we still need to do round two. I'm on here into the comments. Like, let me look at them real quick instead of working. Instead of working. That was some good cheese mesito, huh? Good topic. What other topics should we... <sighs> oh, yeah. Wearing a mask is very important as well, guys. Make sure to be wearing a mask at all times when you guys are working. Um, ew. Really? That's what it was? Portia, you give me German food vibes. 
Um, these nails, I just pull them out. All right, let's let's keep filing. So I forgot what I was saying. Oh yeah, wear a mask. I'm not wearing a mask at the moment because I'm. I should be though. Um, cause I'm here at home, but at work I always wear a mask, always. And I say that because once I was working, um, when I just started doing nails, everything that happened to me was when I started. Thankfully. That way I fucking took care of myself later. Um, I guess I swallowed so much dust that day because I talk a lot that I could not talk the next day. It's like I had a sore throat, but I wasn't sick. It was so scary. I was like, what the fuck? <sighs> so ever since then, I always wear a mask. Fuck that shit. And don't be cheap with your masks either. They have this mask that has a carbon filter. That's actually very good for us nail techs. They're a little bit more expensive, but they're definitely worth it. Your health is more important, okay? Um, it traps the little chemicals in the filter. Um, I couldn't find them after like during COVID no more because obviously everybody was buying masks like crazy. But preferably use those. The carbon filter mask. They have like four or five layers or something like that. And if you guys smell the mask, you guys can smell the chemicals on there. I, I would change it after every client. Are they disposable? Yes, you change it after every client. Um, Paige, you'll get used to it with the masks. That's why I think when COVID happened, I was used to wearing masks because I forced myself to breathe in them. I feel like when I was forced to wear a mask around quarantine is when I felt like I was going to die. But it's like I've been doing this forever. Why can I not breathe now? But then I was like, bitch, because normally you sit and you do nail with a fucking mask. You don't be walking and shit. Can I see your hand model? Yes. Here she is. She's right here. I can be breathing all the air. Okay, Paige. You're funny. Okay, ma'am. Alright, that's what I'm fighting. I don't like to file. I don't like to file no more. I'm lazy. Alright, let me file the tips now. Okay, now let me file the little tip. Just the tip. Let me push them in. All right, hand. Let me put her on my chest. This is the only thing that I don't like about the half hand. It's like, how am I supposed to file you? I normally put it on top of something like it wiggles and shit. Let me put it here. <sighs> Ma'am, sit your ass down. Maria, relax. Yeah, that was the Manny Pro passport hand file. Maria, relax. Relax. Or no more appointment for you. Hold on. I filed it a little sideways. Yeah, I'm fighting with fucking Maria here. This bitch doesn't doesn't let me file her nails, and then she bitching that I didn't file them right, and it's they're not crisp, and she can't scratch her man's back properly. Like, bitch, I tried to tell you to sit straight, but you're fucking playing around here. 
That's what you get for playing with your fucking phone and leaning like a shola. What color is the burnt orange one? It is number 117. I'll leave it right here so you guys can see it. 117 and chai spice. Yeah, that's what most of my clients tell me they do with their nails. Scratch their man's back. It's like, well, if they're making you scratch them, they're dulling the edges. They better pay for your nail. She putting you to work. The fuck? I know y'all comment a lot, huh? 62 messages you just looked away for two seconds. Imagine me? It's like I miss a whole story, a whole cheese me time. Put in that arm, guys. Oh, shit. If y'all want some crisp, crisp nail, you gotta put in that muscle. If you don't want to put in that muscle, then you need the on point disc. But I ain't pulling that bitch out right now. Fuck that. We gotta show Maria we could do this without a drill bit. Don't date Portia. She ain't gonna scratch her back. Why? Cause she don't got nails on. She'll make a scratch stick with nails for you. All right, now let me. <sighs> These nails are bomb, huh? Bomb, bomb, bomb. I think today I'm going to make them matte. All right. So that's what they look like. Let me just dust, dust, dust. They looking cute. All right. Now let me just buff this bitch real quick. Just a little bit. Buff, buff, buff. Buff the nail. Buff the nail. Don't forget to keep tapping. If you guys are enjoying this live, tap, tap, tap. Hi, Janie. How are you? All right, let me just finish buffing this and then I'm going to go wash her hands real quick because she a dusty ass bitch. So let me go wash her hand and pull up my pants first because they sagging. All right, I'll leave you guys here with this hand. Meanwhile, she goes to wash hand. Honey, go wash hand. Like, do you want me to put soap? Yes, bitch, put soap. Okay. Okay, I'm just asking. This is Halloween. This is Halloween, Halloween, Halloween. Okay, my friend is all nice and dry. Okay. 
Okay. Hello, Zuleha. Netflix movie time with Mr. Harrington phone. Okay. Nice, nice. All right, let me move my shit here. I had a movie night yesterday. <clears throat> I was forced to watch it. All right. So let me get my lamp out so that I can do matte top coat on two nails. I'm gonna be using I'm gonna be using my super matte no wipe on the two orange nails. So let me just wait for them to fully dry. I put um soap and water on the hand. Alright, so I'm gonna do the matte top cone on these. And then I feel like I swallowed all this kind of fucking, um, what is it called? All this freaking dust and shit. Oh, it looks so pretty shiny. And <laughs> no scoop for you, friend. Who for who? All right, so I'm gonna do that one. Let's do the pinky, kinda looks like chocolate. Chocolate. What is Paige doing that no scoops for her? Oh, that's Paige's pull? Oh yeah, she does be talking to that friend. Paige, who are you talking to? Portia? Fucking Paige always fighting with Portia. Can you show us your nails? Yes, I'll show them to you right now. Let me just put this bitch in the in the light. Scoops for me, scoops for me. So this is one hand. This is the one that I did yesterday. It's so fucking pretty. I love it. And then these are my, my other ones. Don't look at the thumb. The thumb was never finished. All right. I'm going to go ahead. Since I'm going to put it in the lamp already. I'm going to do the shiny as well. Mine as well. You know. Ooh. Look at the gloss. Honey. Well. Well, 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 so shiny. Well, well, well. I don't know if y'all can see that, but zam, zam. I love glitters. Zam, Zaniel, you shiny. You shiny. For those of you guys who have not tried my top coat, what you're waiting for, honey, is like lip gloss for your nail. I'm I'm debating if I should rename this gel to lip gloss for your nail. But then I already know that there's going to be somebody who's going to try to put it on their mouth. Okay. Oh no, I'm not supposed to whistle, huh? All right, let me um put this in the lamp. Hold 
the top coat is different from the pointer and the pinky finger yes i put a um, matte top coat on the pointer and the pinky oh no no, no i'm lying so i use a matte top coat and a shiny top coat right now Um, they told me that I'm not supposed to whistle at night. Well, we are not supposed to whistle at night because we summon the demons or something like that. I don't know if it's true or not, but I, I don't want to find out. Or something, something like that. Something like that. Nail gloss? Doesn't somebody already have that? I think... Not polish and has their top coat called like that already. Oh no, it's called gloss it. Zule, who told you that? I don't remember. Somebody on here. Amo tus trabajos. Gracias, amiga. Well, meanwhile, this dries. Let me put cuticle oil on my fingers. Hola de Colombia. Hola, hola. Can we see the red ones? Yes, let me just put cuticle oil because I don't want people to talk shit. Gloss it. Yeah, for a few years now, I've been saying I wanted to call it lip gloss, but I never did. Because then I have to change my whole packaging and pay all over for that. And I'm like, do I really need, do I really need it to be named lip gloss? All right. Ooh, girlfriend. Ooh. Hold on, let me put it in there a little bit more. Yeah, I'm gonna restart the live um when when I when I'm done with this one. Alright, so check out my new little crystals that I have. These are some of the new ones that I had been waiting for, but I only got three colors this time. I have been dying to use them. And then also the gold ones, but like, where'd they go? Where'd they go? Today we're gonna keep it simple. Just a little bit. Let me find my gold bling and ling a ling ling. Where'd they go? Where'd it go? I don't have too many gold ones, so. Let me pour them over here. Bitch. If only I could scoop them out. Bitch. You know what? Ain't nobody got time to be scooping shit out. I'll just grab them from this same box. Okay. Oh, my stomach is hurting. Alright, let me get my little bling bling tool. Let me get my bling adhesive out. Where you at? And then I'm probably going to use a little shape in here. Oh, definitely need a shape. It can't be that simple either. Hold on. Let me find them. <sighs> I was putting away my stuff. Oh, here it is. I was putting away my, my bling -a ling ling I'm going to use the golden shadow. Um, I don't know. Maybe this one. Or maybe the rhombus. Um, or maybe the pear. Ooh, too many options. Too many options. Alright, so none of these crystals are Swarovski. Just in case somebody's going to ask. These are the Zule crystals. Um, a crystal golden shadow. The, the little brown ones. 
and then i did go ahead and add a few of these other ones onto my website just in case because i was like Ooh, i wish they were a little darker but they are gonna do i was like fine i'll share with some bitches it's okay so i'm just gonna do something semi-simple on this one and then i'll do a little crazier on the other one i'm gonna do a big orange one And then I'm gonna do the next size in this one. So the really big one is a size 6 mm. Damn bitch, you dried on me already? You do that on top of my top coat? The fuck? Hold on, let me check it straight. Mm, I mean, it passes. The big one is a 6 mm, which is like a size 30 or so. I don't know exactly. And then um, the smaller one is a 5mm, which would be a like a size 22 or something. Oh, shit. Bitch, come to mama. I'm just going to make a little long... A long, 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 long here for the golden one. And this one is crystal golden shadow. I stay putting some crooked as bling, so don't mind that. Damn, I could totally see how crooked I did that. Zule, why you playing? Why you playing, honey? Yeah, that one needs to be moved. Hold on, let me move that one because, girl, it's extra crooked. Take bling to the pop up. I'll try to take some bling, but. Damn. That shit was stuck. Oh my gosh. Hey, hey, hey. What's going on here? You are not supposed to be moving. Oh my god. No, this is not the good good. She's not getting the good good. But it's like the good good. Because it's bomb, bomb, bomb. So. Fuck, man. I'm over here trying to fix you, ma'am. And your fucking crystal decides to dry? Like, what the fuck? What the fuck? I know I fucked up over here. Now I'm about to make you shiny. Alright, I'm just gonna put two little diamonds on the side. And I'm over here trying to not fucking put a lot of... um. A lot of of glue so that they don't they don't stick as well so I could recycle them, you know? And I was gonna say she couldn't even afford her thumb. Damn, you guys are making fun of my client now. Like that Maria, they clowning on you, girl. You ain't gonna back yourself up. You're going to back yourself up. Hello. This looking like Thanksgiving for sure. Thanksgiving vibes. Let me put these little ones up here. Oh, they don't fit. They do not fit. Hmm. Fuck my life. I don't have one small enough. To fit in there, so I'm gonna have to put a, a ball. I'm gonna put a little ball in there. Oh, you know what? I have the the flat bags in here. Mm. 
So I'm going to use a rose gold flat back, flat back ball. A flat ball over here to fit in this gap because I don't have a crystal that's small enough. And it still fits the color. Ooh la la, so pretty. So check this out. Let me zoom it in. These are not the good goods, but they shine so beautiful. They're the Zule Crystals. Amigas. So I'm putting shit on this one or this one. We just doing the the basic ones. Ooh, ooh wait. I have another shape over here. I have a raindrop. So this one, the raindrop is part of the four color box. The four different color box. If you know, you know. If you've been on my store lurking around, you know what it is. Look at the simple nail. <laughs> For real, huh? And then I'm going to do something here. In the middle. It's not as simple as I was hoping, but fuck it. I just can't get myself to be simple. When. What? Was I going on ladies? Show some love. Don't hate. Tap the screen. We're so amazed at this beauty going on. That's why. They're like no tapping right now. Just likey likey. Oh my god. That color is so pretty. These low-key remind me of the gingerbread cookie. Or like a little cornucopia. I cannot do simple, I swear to God. I just can't. It's like, baby Jesus, why are you, why are you playing with me? Hola. Hola amigas, bienvenidas. Ya vamos por terminar este diseñito, pero ahorita empezamos otro. So I kind of um, shoved that ball. Is it the same size? Doesn't look like it. So if you guys ever want like a little pop of something, just use caviar balls. Right? They said it's kind of simple. It's not too over the top, but it's still simple because if you had a thumb, that one would be simple too, you know? All right, I'm just going to put two more balls here. Two more balls. Why is your client hand so shaky? I think she had a little too much coffee. She drank a little too much coffee or she needs a little coffee. And then one more ball right there. One little ball. I was going to put a raindrop, but nah. I think that's good enough. Love that they aren't simple. <laughs> they are simple. Zule, you're about to be done hella early tonight. Tell me they're simple because they are. They are. I just put a little bit of bling. They remind me of a that fucking bread, the fruit cake or whatever the fuck. Mm -hmm. I try to keep it simple, man. But if you guys want it to be extra simple, then pretend there's no bling on them. Maybe just one little diamond in the index and that's it. I tell you whatever you like, friend. 
they're pretty simple. I feel like I could not live with myself if they were any less bling. Bling, 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 bling. No más te falta el pavo, for real. I feel like they do look like turkey vibes. I'm like, come on, come on, come on, come on. All right, let's start with the next set. We got time. We got time. Okay, I'll try to do the next one a little bit more simple. I'll try. I can't promise you nothing. But we're going to try. All right, should we do it on the same hand? Yeah, huh? Because I don't want to do the other one. Okay, let me end the live. Do a bling set, ditch the simple. Okay, okay, okay. You know what? I do want to do a um a bling one. Can you use Cafisto collection? We need to make up for the last set. Okay, fine. No simple vibes. We need me some set. Do short nails. Okay, well, before we end the live, let's think next set black. Do pink. Okay, we need to think of a color. Pink or orange. Short nails. Why you guys want me to do short nail? Do a poll. Pink or orange. Pink and black. Black and purple. Blue, dark blue. Pink, green, emerald, black and pink accents, purple and orange, pink, long, dark blue. Okay, so we're going to pick between, yeah, we just need to see the most popular colors. We're going to go from pink or black. So um, let's do a poll for black or pink. All right, let's see. Oh, you started one? Okay, thank you. Meanwhile, I'm going to start switching out these nails. Let me, let me save these bitches over here. Did you guys do the paw already? Do a set with Maleficent with Halloween. Okay, okay, okay. Let me do a poll then. So the poll is going to be um, pink. It's going to be the happy face. I'm going to start the poll right now. <laughs> a five minute poll, Portia. Okay, let me start a new poll. We're gonna do pink. Um, let's see. Poly, 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 poly. Pink or black? Oh, no, okay, 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 fine. Since I've been doing a lot of black, I'll do it either emerald. That's a good one. Emerald color or... Um, or pink, fuck it, because I do want to do a bright color. All right, that's the the different color. Okay, emerald is gonna be happy face, or pink, crime face. All right, if you guys want to see emerald color, oh shit, what the fuck? There's a fucking pole still. Okay, go. Pink is 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 the crime face, and emerald green is the happy face. Okay, I guess we're doing emerald. That is like a fall color, I guess. So you vote down here with the little faces. So I'm going to vote for green. Oh, shit. I meant to say pink. I just wanted to join the club. The one that's winning. All right. So I guess it's going to be green, 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 green. All right, guys. Well, I'm going to end this live so we can start a new one. Um, that way, um, when I download them for YouTube, it's easier for me to split the videos as well. So.
go get merch yeah i need to find my colors so we're gonna take a little five minute break meanwhile i find gather my my things and then we'll be back in action to do an emerald vibes okay we'll be back